Uh, I've never tried baking something with that ends in such a little thin point, but wish me luck. Hi guys, welcome to my Christmas countdown. Today is day seven, yes, day seven of the 12 cakes of Christmas. So you should check out all my previous Christmas tree cake. You will understand why today I am still rebelling against the traditional cake. So today's cake will not look very Christmassy, but it is a Christmas tree made with the same mold. On the seventh day of Christmas, the cake that came to be is a white, shimmery, um, it's a white, shimmery, snow-covered tree. Okay, for this cake, I am going to start with uh, an eight inch round board. I have two of them glued together. I put a dollop of buttercream in the middle and I'm gonna get my cakes here. I put it in the fridge, I have cut the backs of them, bo both cakes. I put a thin layer of buttercream in the middle, glued them together, and then I crumb coated the whole thing with Swiss meringue buttercream. And now, put it to the side. I have white fondant. I'm gonna roll it out, and I'm going to cover the whole cake and, and hope that it doesn't just fall apart. I uh, never tried baking something with that ends in such a little thin point, but wish me luck. And now, it's ready to be shimmerized. We're going to make, um, I'm gonna go find all kinds of glittering, sparkling, pretty things, and I'm gonna make a whole mix of that. And then I will cover this in piping, I will paint the whole thing with piping gel, and then I'm gonna cover it with shimmer. This is pretty much it. So I now I'm going to look around the cake and see if I find some spots that need some more of these uh, little gold draggies or dra I don't know how to say it. All right, those little sparkly little balls. And then I'm gonna just add them with my hands like this. And once that is done, then the cake is done. And you have a very, very pretty, elegant and it almost looks like a decoration. It doesn't look like a cake, so you can use it as a centerpiece or something like that. Okay guys, this is it. This is, I think it came out looking very elegant, almost like a ceramic tree, a porcelain tree. So you can use it as a centerpiece or a decoration and then your guests will be super surprised when you cut into it and it's actually a cake and delicious. So there it is. Bye bye cake. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching my 12 Cakes of Christmas countdown. If you haven't seen the other videos, please go back and check out my other Christmas videos. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up. And thank you so much for watching.